Okay, so we have a clog. There's a clog in the kitchen sink. And we know that the clog is not in the sink or in the pipes in the sink because when we open this trap, the water comes out. This is the washroom trap. And the water's backed up in there too. So we have these. And these are the breathers for the uh, for the pipes. Basically, they allow the water to flow uh, without a vacuum. So everyone has these on their house normally. Every house that I've seen with a drain has these. So we're gonna just run a snake down through it, see what we come up with. Pretty easy to do. I've already ran a snake down those over there. Those, they go about uh, 20 feet and then I can't get any more line in. So, let's run this one down here and see what happens. Okay, so this is like the next door apartment here. And we've got the crawl space here. Look, in here, that it's like the main line right there. Right here, it goes up into their sink, into the next door apartment sink. Then it goes... What's probably happened is... It goes down right there. There's a trap right there I could probably take out and see if it's leaking. Probably a clog right in one of these elbows or a Y. Right there. Could be a problem area. So there's a trap. I can run my short snake through that. Down to there and down there. See so, yeah, how? That's probably about a. Maybe 30 foot stretch. Okay, I've disconnected this so I can get a straight shot. You can see the water's backing up in here. I'm gonna run my snake down there. I should have enough snake to go down pretty darn far at least, which doesn't say a lot. Um, but yeah, give that a try. Okay, so, see this is kind of hazardous here. We got asbestos pipe lining. Should have been out with the 50s. And then our clog is right about here. And somewhere in the middle there. My snake goes to about here. So I'm gonna have to bring my electric snake because I can't seem to push it by hand. So this is the job for the super snake. I have to come back when the tenants are here and so I can use their power. Okay, so this one, I need to bring in the heavy artillery here. I just, just wouldn't come out with this little one. I couldn't get this little one to work through it. So I got this one incher here. Okay, I got it all hooked up. Not leaking. I'm running the hot water from the washroom. Washer and dryer hot water spigot down here. Now, uh, I don't advise plugging this because what happens is if you plug this, then it may back up somewhere inside the house. I don't advise forcing it down here. Um, uh, so I don't advise forcing it down under pressure uh, because it can back up in the vent lines and cause pressure somewhere down the line which may spill into your um, into your house so we don't want that so it looks like this one's good thanks for tuning in if you need any help you can contact me Mr. Maintain at Hotmail I give phone advice for $25 707-443-8347 thanks for watching